Welcome everybody to Sexpress. In today's episode, we're going to be walking through how to connect your GoDaddy domain to Google Workspace, leveraging your custom domains into Google Workspace, not only enhances the professional image, but also consolidates your digital tools under one cohesive brand. Whether you are a business, an educator, or a freelancer, both are great and efficiently. Let's get started. The advantage of connecting GoDaddy domain with Workspace. Connecting your GoDaddy domain to Google Workspace allows you to use Google powerful suits of tools on your own domain name be it for email, calendar, or other collaboration tools. Ensure that you have your GoDaddy domain ready to Google Workspace account set it up. Let's begin by configuring your domain into GoDaddy. Configuring your GoDaddy domain. Logged in into your GoDaddy. Go directly into your products and focus into the domain that you wanted to move on. Now, Google Workspace will provide you with the essential stuff to link it. So this is where we will link your domain to Google Workspace. We'll be adding some specific DNS records provided by Google Workspace. Now, obtaining a DNS information for Google Workspace. First of all, switch to Google Workspace dashboard. During the actual setup, Google Workspace will provide you with essential DNS records we used that before. But let's say, for example, that you already have added your actual domain. So let's add a new one. If I go directly into manage my domains into the administrator tools, as you can see, we have one domain. Let's go and add a new domain. Now here into your domain name, what you want to do is to paste the domain that you have into GoDaddy, which in this case is this one. And there we go. Now here is the user alias uh, domain. So let's go and start the verification. Now this record carefully as they are crucial for the next step. Updating the DNS records into GoDaddy. Back into your GoDaddy account, go to the DNS setting for your domain. Here, what you wanted to do is to add all the stuff that were generated here involving the mx records to redirect the email traffic to google mail servers so if you go into add new record i'm gonna hit now back here and as you can see we go to step number two as you can see we have the verification record of txt verification and here we needed to copy the verification code which is actually this one now in here we have the host name the alias if this one has a ttl just leave it like that and come back here and protect the domain so let's go here into your domain once again i'm going to try to reload the page and once you have access what you want to do is to add a new record remember to choose txt now here into name we can go for add the value should be exactly this one so i'm going to copy it paste it in here and the t double t l you can enter any value so in this case i'm going to just leave this by default and hit now into save so succeed your dns record have been updated successfully now verify your domain with google workspace after updating your dns records into godaddy it's time to verify your domain with google workspace the verification is essential to activate your workspace services with a custom domain hidden to protect your domain just wait till the verification record for this domain has now been added sometimes this might be taking a minute sometimes it might be taking up to five minutes so just wait a few seconds here come back and reload your page and there we go you should go directly into done and you should see that your verify uh domain has now been successfully done that is it you have to you have successfully connected your godaddy domain to google workspace now you can enjoy the full suite of google workspace tools with a domain name that showcases your brand and professionalism if this story was helpful guys please give us a thumbs up consider subscription to express for more guides on domain management and google workspace any questions or additional tips you feel free to tell them into the comments below thank you for watching best of luck with the google workspace integration stay tuned for the text for us from more tech tutorial guys and tips see you soon